So here we are on Thursday, May 27th, 2021. Steve has had an impacted ear. We took him to the doctor uh, about a week ago. Thought he had an ear infection and they said that his ear was packed with wax. So much so that it was like a rock in there. <clears throat> so he was going to go back and have the doctor flush it. But I still wanted to do it. He agreed. And I got some stuff off of Amazon to help us. So Debrox right here is what the doctor recommended. Um, that we use for a week in advance. Um, he said a couple drops in each ear every night, laying on your side for five minutes <clears throat> after inserting the drops and then um, adding cotton to it just so it doesn't run out because it's oily. Um, then after that, I've watched some YouTube videos of my own and learned... Uh, how to do this flush with this bottle that was $15.99 on Amazon here's the bag that it comes in so it's a, like a whole system and this is the bottle inside with this little tip here the tip can be cut it says for comfortableness so if we insert it in his ear and it's not comfortable for him we could always shorten that tip if need be and then one part hydrogen peroxide to four parts of warm water and the warm water should not be any cooler than body temperature because it can cause dizziness. And then this is what we'll use to catch the gunk or whatever we get coming out of his ear. So let's get started. I'm going to flip the camera around here. Okay, so here we go. We've set up here. I feel like that's upside down because that's upside no, down. No, it's not. Why are the numbers upside down? Oh, yeah, because you started. There you go. See, now you're going again. Same video. Okay. Ready? And I can't see what I'm filming now, so you got to... Well, you're kind of by your ear. Tell me where you want it. I want it about right there. And then if you can... No, I can't because my other shoulder and arm... Okay. Did you check the temperature on it? Yes, I did. You didn't check that. That's cold. That's cold? Go, go. It might be from maybe the peroxide mix. It feels cool. Okay, go on, go on. It's starting to warm up. Was there some in the hose or something? Might have been. <gasps> Pause. Take two. So if you move too much, the tip will fall off of the uh, hose on the spray bottle. Can you feel anything yet? Doesn't feel bad. Is this seeing anything? Yep. Well, it just got loud, like maybe you pushed a piece out or something. Is there anything in the cup? No, but you are, can you hold the cup more like that? So that way I can see your ear canal because you were kind of closing your ear canal off. Okay, that's why it got loud because it opened the ear canal. Okay. It says if your ears are super impacted that this will not happen with the first bottle that you may have to use this a time or two depending on the impact to the ear. We did do a camera video. Oh, right there feels like a good spot. Um, in his ears, and we could see the buildup. 
prior to this. What is, how's the temperature of the water feel now, babe? It's not too hot. Uh, when you get a lot of air in there, it really hurts, so. Well, that's why I was trying to hold my hand there, but then I didn't want to. Mm. Like the air bubbles hitting it hurt. Uh. I wonder. <gasps> oh, okay. Hold that there. Okay, so now we can see. Oh, 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 the best part. We could see right here. Can you see that on the tip? Right, right here. Here it comes. So we're making some progress. I'm gonna dump this out, but look inside here. Can you tilt this in here, babe? You can look inside of it. Can you do it? You're moving it around. So you can see some debris in there. Here, give me the camera and I'm gonna flip it. Hang on so I can do your ear. Give it to me, please. Ooh, there we go. Okay, and I'm gonna round. And you can see here what we've started to get out. Oh, bad. This is gonna get better by the minute. Okay, and then love this stuff. Okay, ready? You hold again. Love you. My hand is in the way there. Can you see what's on your ear? I'll, I'll show you the video later. Don't worry about yeah. it. Okay, because it's coming. Can you hold this with your left? Mm. Oh, that's good, babe. That's much better than we had it the first time. Um, actually, you're turned away so far now, I can't see your ear. Okay, that's about down by that spot where you had, uh... Yeah, it's coming. Yeah. Hold on, hold on. You got this on backwards. No? No, okay. what on backwards? Okay, I thought the container was on because it's leaking. I just I have to pull up to see what... Yep. You're not down in that canal part, though. Are you out of fluid? Nope. Not yet. We got... Here, pull that towel up and leave it on the sink. The bottom part. Because it's running down me. Got you. Put it under my arm. Kind of. Okay. Here's... That was a pretty big piece I just knocked off of there. But you're closing the air canal again with that. You're holding it too tight, babe. There you go. Yeah, but it's just running water all over me. I understand. You're not, you don't have the tip down in there. Move the tip around until... Here, hold the camera. Because I can feel when it gets in there. It's hot. Well, is this all this connected? Okay, don't put it on the sink. Okay, we just tried to rearrange this here because it was just leaking on him so much and going back you're not down there far enough well i feel like there's wax there and that's why you can't feel it far enough Oh yeah. Okay. Don't move. Don't move. So I'm just going to interject here. There's some on the end. So I went to go get this scooper tip. It's soft. Um, so that way we can pull it off of the end. But then Steve thinks it's way to go with Harbor Freight Pittsburgh Tools carving set. They work great for taxidermy on deer ears ears and noses um so the that would be no yeah. we don't put metal in the air i do 
for taxidermy, it works great. They're dead. You're not. <gasps> Holy heck. Hey, before we go back to it, you could see. Oh, nice, nice, nasty there. And look at his ear here. So while I've got this like this, I'm going to use this tip so you can see exactly what we're pulling out. Oh, that's a big chunk. Holy heck. Oh, beard. Wow. That was a big chunk. I'm still waiting for the mother load. So we did get some good stuff movement here. Baby, you want to look at that before I put the stuff back so you can see? Oh, yeah. Crazy, huh? Yeah, video it in the sink now. Yeah. That's so gross. Okay. So we're going to set this up again. Hold on. So I walk away to go get more warm water and I add peroxide and he tells me it's not warm enough so I need to go warm it up in the microwave and then I and he's reading this yeah doesn't seem like a safe idea I don't heat up uh, peroxide yeah you release the hydrogen yeah don't heat up peroxide so good thing we knew that before we started so we're gonna go with what we got all right so this is our second bottle of water we're starting with here I just went and filled uh, How long was it to go in half? How is that? Still cold, keep going. That's why I stuck it in the nozzle, keep going. Okay. Good? Yeah, definitely more. Okay. So, here we go again. You know, hold on. Just wiggle it around and push it down in there, please. That one time you got it down in nice and deep, and that's when you got best results. I don't feel it going all the way in there yet. Well, do you think it could be because there's wax near the end here? Yeah. And babe, it's as far in as it'll go. Well, but pull it out and wiggle around until it goes down in there. This sounds like a nasty video now. That's it. It's not going down in the canal, but go ahead. I, I don't know what more to do with it. Oh, I can see wax right here. I think you have wax there, and that's why it's not going down there, because I could see it right here. Thank you. I'm going to try it. How does that feel as far as where it's hitting? It doesn't feel right. It's not going all the way down in there. Well, here, hold still, because you have, oh, there's, there's a chunk right there, probably not in view very good. Hold still, don't close off your thing, you're pushing too tight on that little I'm nut. trying to pull it down. Cause I, I know, but, oh, right there, keep it right there. Way. More. Hold still. Right there. Oh, oh. Easy, easy, easy. Oh, okay. pull it out. Ooh. 
because now you got it all the way in there. Okay, see, so Ooh, now I found the sweet pressure. spot. Oh, and you, you tell do me. Do you remember how you got that in that? Part? No, I don't. But then maybe don't pulse as hard. Okay, hold. Right it here. feels like you're puncturing it. Okay, hold. Yeah, it's going the right way. Yeah, very easy. Right to, uh, 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 oh, wow. It's like you were pushing pressure against it. No different than I was uh, before. Do you want me to just stop? No, 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 keep going. But if if I feel pressure, you might have to pull it out just a touch. That's what I said. Oh. Uh. Yeah, that's the right angle now. Because it was like going against the side of the ear canal instead of towards the eardrum, you know? Yeah. Now we're like going right at the eardrum. That's why it's so sensitive. So maybe it's opened some things up there. Was this the bad ear? No. So the other side is the worst one. Yeah. Oh, right there. That feels like you're getting way down in there now. Oh. See, it's a better angle. It's not just pushing against the side of the ear drum and dripping out, or the ear canal. But you saw that angle you had to go in to get to the canal, right? Because now, like, you can get in there. How's that? It's not all the way there, but okay. It feels like you're going towards the side of the canal again, but not towards the eardrum, but that's all right. It's still not the right angle, but that's all right. Go ahead and just keep flushing and see what you get. Well, see, I'm getting, this is starting to blow off of here. Yeah, it's not getting down by the ear drum. There it is. Ah. Did you do you know what you had to do with that last movement to get it there? I'm not sure. This has been trial and error from the start. You gotta pay attention because there's a certain way you go back and you come back and lean and it'll get there. Are you gonna take these same instructions? Yeah, when it leans, it's a ah. ah. Oh, pull back a little bit. Oh. Like the hose was resting on something and causing pain. But that's the angle you have to get to uh, do it. When I say pull back, maybe just pull back a quarter of an inch or something. Just so instead of poking into the eardrum, it just relaxes pressure off of the eardrum, you know? Okay, keep going. Did you get anything? No. Oh, that's it right there. That was the angle that you have to go at. Did you see how you did that? Yep. Because that was like first shot. <sighs> Instead of all shh, just kind of gently. Yeah. That's an even amount of pressure there. <sighs> Nothing's coming forward. Nothing? No. There it is. Now do your... If nothing comes out, we'll move on to the next year. No, the tip. Are we done then? Well, you tell me. You want to look in there? I have to shut the video off if we're going to do that. Is that what you want to do? Sure, because it's already 20 minutes long. Wow. Okay. That's what we got.